I've never known racism. Back where I'm from, it's a very multicultural community. I grew up around all sorts of people. Chinese, Indian, Korean, Japanese, Pakistani. Well, I mean, all of us are Asian. My parents are both Chinese. Even back then, we were seen as the minorities, but we weren't really treated that much differently. We were more focused on the bigger picture of race. It was us Asians against you Westerners. And I sort of lived with that idea for my whole life. I don't know where I got it from. My parents, their parents, the parents before them. But us kids, we just kind of lived with the, f with the knowledge that, okay, be careful of those kids. 2022, there were some rumble in Hong Kong. My parents one day just walk up to me. My dad grabs me by the shoulder. Son, we're going to the UK. Huh? I'm not gonna lie. I was worried. Keep in mind that we were moving midst COVID-19 and the news, the news would not stop telling me a Chinese, a Vietnamese, a Japanese, a Korean guy getting beat up in the middle of the street of UK. That, that really ruined my desire of coming to the UK. I still remember my first few social interactions in the UK and they weren't really that nice at all. It didn't take long for people to notice my American accent coming out from my Asian face. There was this one kid who pointed at me. He said, Hey yo, Hing Hang Hong Hang Hing, I'm speaking your language. And there was a moment where I thought about it. What can I do about it? I'm the minority here. Just think about how many people you have come across that just spat a slur at you. How often do you get the stare down just because of the color of your skin? How many times has someone said no to you just because you are different from them? But now, think about how many people you've come across that haven't done any of those things. How many people have greeted you with bright smiles in the morning whilst you get a coffee? How many people have you cracked jokes with, ignoring everything else in the world? The longer you spend somewhere, the more you learn about the people. It's age-old knowledge that you can't assume everyone of a racist criminal just because one of them robbed a store. But it also goes the other way, doesn't it? Why did I assume everyone here would attack me just because of one news article? Just because of one kid? That doesn't seem fair, does it? How many relationships, bonds, connections have I missed out on just because I failed to reach out to people? I don't know you. My reality is not the same as yours. I don't live in the same circumstances as you. But honestly, what's stopping you from reaching out to those who do see you for who you truly are? What's wrong with being a little bit different? 